Welcome to our tech troubleshooting video. Today, we're addressing a common issue that many developers encounter when working with PrimeNG's GMAP component. Our viewer is facing a frustrating error. Reference error, Google is not defined. This error typically arises when the Google Maps API isn't properly loaded. We'll also explore how to add an API key to resolve this issue and get your map up and running smoothly. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. If you're encountering the error, reference error, Google is not defined while using PrimeNG GMAP, it typically means that the Google Maps JavaScript API is not loaded in your application. To resolve this issue, you need to include the Google Maps JavaScript API in your project. You can do this by adding a script tag in your index.html file. Make sure to replace your API key with your actual Google Maps API key. You can obtain an API key from the Google Cloud Platform. Once you have added the script tag and your API key, your component should work without the Google is not defined error. Now let's review your component code. Finally, ensure that your HTML template correctly references the GMAP component with the options and overlays you defined in your TypeScript code. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To fix the reference error with PrimeNG GMAP, you need to download and use the Google Maps JavaScript library. Remember, PrimeNG is just an Angular wrapper for this library. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To fix the reference error with PrimeNG GMAP, add a script tag in your index.html file. Make sure to include a valid Google Maps API key. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To resolve the reference error with Google Maps in PrimeNG GMAP, you need to declare the Google variable at the top of your component. This simple addition will fix the issue. Here's how to implement it in your component. Import GMAP module and add the declaration for Google at the top. In the nOnInit method, set up your map options and overlays using Google Maps API. This includes markers, polygons, circles, and polylines. And that's it guys. I hope we've gone through the question and found that solution you're looking for. And look, if we did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.